Welcome back, everybody. We are in action here, and we got some beautiful little fishies wanting a few coffee beans, to say the least. Excellent little jumpy blob fishes. Let's go. Uh, so I did harvest most stuff. Oops, not everything, though, apparently. Nope, not everything. Missed all of this. Oh, yeah. That scythe, though, feels so good. Feels so nice to harvest. It's amazing. All right. Um, On that note, ah, I might just sell them all. The blue jazz are really not... Oh, wait. We have all of this, too. Oh, boy. Yeah. Okay. Um, The blue jazz, I was going to say, they're not making us big bank like at all they're really not like they're doing okay don't get me wrong but like this harvest could be worth it um i don't know if i should reseed like get the seeds from these or just sell them all let's you know what let's sell them all that way we have a benchmark right where would we actually be on a full ish harvest of blue jazz right and then on that note, I need 24 times 8, which is 100 and... What is it? 4 times 8 is 24... No, 32. What am I doing? Jeez. 32 and 160. So what is that? 192? Is that about right? Uh, there. And then I need another 8, 16, uh, 24, and 32. So I actually need 160 plus 64, which equals, oh, geez, that's big math. 160 plus 64, 224 plus another eight or so, or nine. So 224 plus nine. Is that right? I think that's right. I think that's right. Oh, God, the prismatic jelly. Oh, man, so much stuff. Yeah, so 224 plus nine we're looking at 233 total uh items very good all right uh looks like there's also a quest available uh ripe potato we can do that evelyn no problem we do have the desert festival i am just gonna run on over to joja very quickly here and uh pick up those 230 some odd um blue jazz seeds all right so i need what was it <laughs> 160 so 224 so that's good plus nine right so 30 and then three god i hope that's right <laughs> math please i should have done the math before i started the stream Oh God, mistakes were made. No, all things considered, I think it's pretty good. Uh, let's head on back in and we are going to head on over to the Desert Festival for sure as soon as this is done because it is just kind of the thing to do, I think. I think it's a, a fun little new festival and I'm happy that it's a part of the game because the desert never really got much love other than the Skull Cavern. And I'm very happy to see that. So, anyways, I'm going to blue jazz my way into oblivion here. And I'll meet you all out at the desert. Okie dokie, away we go. Let's see what we got today. Um, obviously, all that planting and stuff, I did remember to bring my bombs this time. Uh, no, don't eat it. Gift it. Oh, I've already given them two. All right. Pam's maxed. We got Harvey now. Oh, we can buy calico eggs. Oh, okay. They're a little expensive. Pierre's sign. That's cool. That's pretty cool. I'll take that. That's pretty nice. Oil and wheat flour. Cool. So you could like stock up on some resources. Nice. Uh, what do we got here? Crispy bass mixed flower seeds. Hello. That's not too shabby. That'd be actually pretty good for us. Hi, Clint. How's it going? Have a gift. Look at this shady character over here in the corner on the bench. What do you think he's up to? Trouble. That's what he's up to. Oh my, Haley down in a bikini. What? And a flamingo. What kind of madness is this? 
Hi, Penny. How are you? What's up? Yeah. True. True. Good. Uh, am I maxed with uh, Maru, actually? I don't remember. No, I'm not. Maru, have a cheese. Perfect. All right. Uh, the race is currently in progress. Let's talk later. All right. We'll have to come back. No big deal. Uh, we got Demetrius up here. I can't remember. Did I? I did max out Demetrius. Hi. How's it going? Uh, do we go crazy? Yeah, let's go crazy. All right. What do we got? Uh, yeah, you can. Okay, what should we go with this time? We did the sharp cheddar. Let's go with hearty beans. I like a good hearty beans. Ooh, with a pungent garlic. Nice. That sounds good. I probably should have gone with hot sauce, though. That might have been spicy. Skull cave casserole. What buffs does it get us? Attack and defense. Very cool. Can't go wrong. All right, uh, I think I'm going to forgo willies. Mind you, that's kind of nice, but... All right, pepper seeds, rainbow trout, a potato, <laughs> in case we need it for Evelyn. All right, uh, nothing too crazy there. What do you have again? Did it change, I guess, is the other question mark. Uh, some spicy eel. I'm a little low on spicy eel. That might be a good idea. So it looks like some of the decorations have changed, potentially. Oh god, it's 10 per? Jeez. Louise. That's so expensive. I'll probably just buy out, like, all the mummy masks while I'm at it, you know? Just one of those things. All right, uh, what's up, Robin? Dude, I'm, I'm good with you, right? No, I'm not good with you. I'm not good with you. Have a cheese. Indeed. Enjoy the cheese. All right. Let's see. What do we got? Reach level 30. Ooh, that's tough. Descending in the skulls and slay 10 purple slimes. All right. Let's give that guy a go. I think we might be able to pull that one off uh, decently here. I do like the idea that it's Skull Cavern uh, adding things to it. I, I think that's pretty darn sweet. I'm not going to lie. Adds a little bit of flavor uh, to the game. I think this is a fantastic little uh, addition. I, I don't know if you all feel the same, but I really do think this is a great idea. All right. We got to slay purple slimes. And of course, they're probably going to be like none to be found, right? They're going to be hiding on me. Guaranteed. Guaranteed. All right. Let's blow up a couple. That. Okay. We got a serpent. Not a slime. I need a way down. That's what I need. We also don't have the uh, the best of luck today either. So that's going to play into it as well. You know what? I'm just going to do this. And uh, yeah, I'm not the best at filling dead space sometimes. So, you know, it's a thing. Well, this could do it. In case we were wondering where we were going to get all the slimes from, that should do it for sure. Uh, an infested area on floor six. This is looking very fruitful for us to complete the quest nice and quickly here, uh, which is good. So, yeah, just kind of get it done as quick as possible. All right. How many more? One more. Let's go. All right. Very nice. Very happy to see that. I did get a few other resources around, which was nice as well. Uh, just something that we didn't really have to worry about. Um, I think otherwise I will clear this out. Again, always lock them into a corner if you have the chance to do so with these mobs. It's always uh, much better off doing so. There's a purple bag here. Oh, it's just purple because it's green, apparently. <laughs> I, like, I like it. I like it a lot. All right. Well, a little bit of gold. I'll take it. An extra calico egg. And uh, this one's a pretty easy one to walk on down the train track here. So I'll do this, and then we will uh, basically head on back up to the surface. Ooh, free coal. I'll take that, too. Thank you. Can't go wrong with a little bit of coal. All right. Beauty. Uh, do I do it? Food is half as effective. Interesting. 
Okay. Yeah, that's good enough for me. All right, out of the mine, let's go. We completed our quest. We got ourselves our calico eggs. Um, I guess we could do the fishing thing, right? Or, you know, do I just do... Oh, do I buy... What do I buy? What do I buy? I don't really... I mean, a decorative barrel. Let's get a decorative barrel. That could be very useful. Uh, I don't really need the foraging experience one, I don't think. Mega bombs or mystery boxes? Ten mystery boxes a lot. That's a lot of mystery boxes. I feel like that might be a very good buy. Oh, no, it's one per 20. Okay. I keep doing that. I keep doing that mistake. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's it's a thing. It's a thing. All right. Anyways, um, other than that, I don't think that there was much else that I wanted to get done. Let's try to guess. Ooh, different. Uh, uh, speed Rooster. That's a bait. That's a bait. Uh, let's go with King Sting. That's a good name. Let's do it, Scorpion King. Let's go. Okay, start the race, bud. Yeah, okay. Start the race. Any day now. Any day now. Are they are they gonna go? No? What does free cacti guys got? Do I get another free cacti? So how's the little guy doing? Doing fine. Doing fine. Things are working. Things are working. Alright, there they go. They're off. They're off to the races. All right, let's see. How do we do? How do we do? Can I, like, block them? No, I can't. Okay, that'd be funny, though. Oh, the chicken got scared, though. Chicken got scared. All right. Ooh, I could get a warp to him up here. Not a bad idea, actually. Um, yeah, that's not a terrible idea. I'm going to grab one. Might as well. All right, this race is taking way too long. My time is money here, people. Let's go. Let's go. Sandy's obviously out here, so I assume there's no one tending. Yeah, that's true. All right. Let's go check on our race. All right. They're kind of neck and neck. King Sting is uh, slacking in the jumps. But he's got he's got uh, good good speed at the end, I think. Right? He's going to he's going to do it. Come on, buddy. Let's go. Get going. No, no, chicken. No, no. Oh, chicken, please. Oh, boy. And now the moment you've been waiting for. The speed rooster. I should have been baited. Uh, all right. Well, it is what it is. I'm not betting again. That's just crazy. That's just crazy talk. And I'm also not spending that 250 gold to work back. Like, what madness is that? I shouldn't have paid that the other night. Ridiculous waste of money. All right. Uh, there's a sign. Oh, it is because it pams out at the desert. Probably. That's actually drive yourself. I'm going to the festival as a kid. You have to drive yourself. That's hilarious. Oh, that's funny. All right. Very good stuff. Uh, we need to uh, get prepared, to say the least. We are going to go... Um, I mean, we could go crack some geodes, but I think ultimately, let's put that guy away. Let's sort. That decorative barrel is amazing. It is quite nice. I'm not going to lie. All right. Let's uh place it like, can I not place it there? Oh, I can place it there though. Maybe we'll place it over here somewhere. Yeah. Like nice decorative barrel. That actually looks pretty good. I like that quite a bit. It's a nice little uh, touch. Okay. Uh, we might as well lock them in because we're in the area. Uh, I should probably do the same for the chickens because we have the time to do so. Uh, this does increase their happiness as of 1.6. So kind of a nice thing to do if you do it. And what else is going on? We got a little bit more wild honey. That's good. Uh, we can drop that in our little temporary kind of keg set up here and we are struggling Jeez. honey and wild honey what's the difference there is no difference one i bought all right yeah we're making grape wine right now which is going to take forever okay 
cool. So uh, tomorrow, oh boy, I think we're just going to miss another day on that prismatic jelly, as bad as it sounds. I don't think it's in the cards uh, for us tomorrow either. We could deliver the potato to Evelyn. That might be a good strategy in the morning. Um, other than that, the fish ponds are doing well. We are upgraded with Robin, actually. So, and Robin was out there today. So hopefully, so this is upgraded now, right? Yeah, it is. I can get rabbits if I want to. Okay, noted. Actually, I can move my other chicken back now, too. Because I have the space for it. Oh, they're sleeping. I can't move them while they sleep. That's ridiculous. All right. Um, so that's good. I think we should plan. I'm okay. Well, am I okay with the other coop being small? I guess. I wouldn't mind. We're kind of low on funds, uh, to be honest. We'll see what we get tomorrow, I guess. That's going to be the big, the big needle mover on what we get from all those jazz versus what we spent. So, yeah, no extra forageables. I was just taking a quick peek uh, to see, but doesn't look like it. Up here, I might as well grab my batteries. I forgot about these ones up there. Okay, noted. Noted for next time. All right, and anything in here? Eh, just some blackberry jelly. Not really ideal. Um, I kind of want that to be last. It's going to take a while to work through that. I mean... A little bit of jelly doesn't go too wrong, but it's only 250 bucks, right? So, not ideal. All right. Off to bed I go. I think we have the potential of a busy day tomorrow. Oh, and what did, what did we get for an achievement? Okay. 19 grand. From blue jazz and eight mayonnaise. And a couple of blackberry jellies. Yeah, they're really not doing it, hey? We're not making a lot of money off these blue jazz at all. Like, you think about that, they were 80, 90. I spent 30. So I'm all, not even, like, tripling, right? So, yeah, not the best. Anyways, um, bit of a bad luck day, so that's okay. Uh, I'm actually happy with that because we'll be out in the desert anyways. So I think that'll work out uh, quite well. All right harvest our green beans harvest our blue jazz over here even more jazz yeah i know that the blue jazz is more profitable than the tulips would be but yeah the flower farming is a little rough to say the least all right so that's 24 16 16 32 the so 24 and 32 is 56 uh minus 2 is 54 plus 16 54 plus 16, that's 60, that's 70, plus 24, that's 94, if I'm not mistaken on my math. Uh, so, uh, 94, is that what I just said? <laughs> Should be the magic number. All right, yeah, we're getting a lot of goat cheese, which is nice. Let's sell that. I think we're actually going to make a lot more off of our animals than we are off of our flowers. Just a thing. Just a thing, you know. All right. Anyways, uh, let's get to it. We got a couple more animals to go see. And on top of that, I also would like to move you, change home building, back to the previous one. Oh, God. So slow. Scroll faster. There we go. Beautiful. Back to the desert. What do you got, Elliot? Oh, his pencil. It's a dagger? Oh, that's funny. Uh, tricorn hat. Very nice. Squid ink. Not a bad little setup there uh, at all. Hi. How's it going, Kent? Hopefully you're doing well. What do we got here? A dusty skull, escargot, lobster bisque, and squid ink ravioli. Eggplant parm. That's some nice food, actually. The lobster bisque is quite good at the plus three fishing. Um, I wouldn't mind grabbing one of them, but I might leave it for right now. 
Uh, not like a huge requirement. This, oh man, I'm like way down the list with jazz. Okay. I love presents. Why wouldn't you? Everybody loves presents, don't they? Don't they? All right. Uh, we're back in the desert. Nothing too, too crazy going on. Uh, I think I'm good with Shane, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, last but not least, let's go. I'm very curious to see. Let's go with a cave loaf with a hot sauce. Let's see what this comes up with. I guess you can't try all of them in the first year, which is kind of fun. Hot log. All right. Very good. Uh, mining and speed. Well, I do like the speed aspect of it. That sounds fantastic. Uh, let's pop on over to the trader quickly. One coal. All right. Duck mayo, wool, roasted hazelnuts. I think George loves those. Lobster bisque for sale. The red fez. I, I gotta leave it for now. I gotta leave it. And do you have anything different today? Oh, strawberry seeds are back. Oh, magic rock candy. Okay. Okay. And some calico statues, desert fireplace. Yeah. Okay. So this definitely seems like, I mean, magic rock candy is crazy good, but you can get some cool decorations from this. I'm all for that. I like the idea uh, of some good decorations. Uh, not too bad. Collect 15 pieces of iridium. Ooh, that might be tough. That might be tough. I kind of want to try it, though. Yeah, you know what? Let's just try. Whatever. Let's... Oh, I didn't bring my bombs either. This ain't gonna happen. Not a chance is this gonna happen. I'd have to get super duper lucky for this to happen. And it's not even a good luck day, so... Odds are not in my favor. To say the least. Um, yeah, this ain't gonna go well, not gonna lie. But I also do need to collect copper, uh, or coal for a quest that I accepted from Clint. So, hey, that's cool, you know, get some coal along the way, I guess. Get some resources. It is what it is. I'm not gonna be too, too upset by my choice. I made it. I knew, I knew. This should get me the coal, though, that I need right here, right? Boom, just like that. Hold done. Maybe we can get some, uh, maybe we can get some juicy, uh, fat loot from some of these, uh, monsters. Oh, overrun, hey? Ow. Ow. Oh, overrun indeed. Okay. I'm not that strong. I do have my galaxy sword, but that's about it. Dip, duck, dive, dodge. Okay, we got one iridium. Okay, let's eat a cheese. Because <laughs> we are in... Uh, we were in a health situation, to say the least. We really have to get progressing out on the island here. Uh, getting some enchants and powering up our weapon would uh, help quite a bit. Uh, to say the least, so yeah, it's a thing. I think the only chance that I have of getting all this iridium is from these purple slimes. Like, I'm not even gonna lie, that's probably my best odds. Because getting it from anywhere else is not likely. I believe these ghosts can drop the prismatic jelly, but I'm not positive on that, so I'm gonna try to kill them and see if we can't get lucky. If you know what I mean. That was Omni Geodes. All right, reached a new level of understanding. That's a new mastery skill. That's fun. Uh, haven't, haven't, wasn't even really tracking that one. I don't even know what I want to get next. Oh man, that's a tough one. I mean, I don't think the fishing is, well, the fishing's really good. Foraging's really good as well. I mean, so is the mining, I think, as well. Everything's pretty good. Um, this is not going good, though. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, <laughs> this adventure down here, uh, not the greatest. 
And now that I have that mastery point, I'm trying to think, like, am I better off, um, like, heading back and doing the mastery, you know? Oh, good. Good. Let's get out of that mess. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I've gotten, like, two iridium. It's really, really bad. Like, two. That's it. I did get a Wicked Chris, which is kind of fun. Uh, haven't had one of those in a while. Uh, so that's kind of fun to, to see. But yeah. Two. Two. That's it. That's all. So yeah, not ideal. We do have... We are getting other resources, which is really quite nice. Uh, don't get me wrong, but... Uh, yeah. Who's not going to pay the bills? Very long here. Um, we have gotten a few bombs, which have helped from the uh, serpents, which is good. Kind of clear out a little bit of area. Get more resources in a foul swoop, right? Um, rather than breaking them with my pickaxe. Hey, we got a hole. Let's jump down there. So yeah, I think we'll just keep going. Okay, only three levels. And all right, we got mummies. Well, I can work on my uh, mummy uh, hero thing. Okay, uh, good, and bomb. There we go. Blow them up. Yeah, I hear a serpent. Very good. All right. Yeah, nothing too crazy, though. It's been pretty tame, uh, to say the least. So we'll uh, keep on going, I guess, until I can't go anymore. And that'll be that. All right, I'm just going to warp back. We're not even going to use our eggs uh, this year, I don't think. Um, you know, all of the loot and such was cool. But uh, yeah, just one of those little details. I think we're going to save it for next year. It seems like that might be the better play anyways. Um, to kind of save and, and do it next year. In my personal opinion. But, eh, I mean, I could be wrong. Other people will probably disagree with me on that, but that's okay. Um, other than that, like I said, it's pretty late, so let's just hit the hay. I did fail a quest with Evelyn. I forgot to bring the potato, which I was supposed to. But, uh, you know, things happen. Not a big deal. Um, another 8,600 in blue jazz, so not too, too bad. It's some money, but it's not a lot of money. I don't think I make good money until my honey... <laughs> Or my, um, I get into the fairy rose, right? Penny gives me a lot of food. Like pancakes, hash browns. I've gotten quite a bit of food. All right, um, I think I'm going to head on down. Ooh, spicy eel from George. Nice. I think I'm going to head on down and let's select our mastery point. I'm not even probably going to replant those. All right. We got to let out the animals. We got to do the morning chores, as bad as it sounds. And, uh, yeah, I'll be back shortly. All right, we did have some fairy rose that came uh, to bloom, which is great. Uh, always nice to have that surprise when you jump on into the old greenhouse. Uh, one day for our first ancient fruit as well. So that's right around the corner. We'll have to remember that come tomorrow. All right. I am making a few more of those guys. We also got some coffee beans and, and the sorts. Uh, let's put all of that away. And let's sell all of these fairy rows. I don't know if I actually made enough seeds. I hope I did um, for them. But here's hoping. All right. What do we have? We need to get... I need to go talk to Clint. Okay. That works perfectly. Let's go bust some geodes. We haven't done that. And let's go see. We got to buy 94 seeds. And then we got to go to the cave as well. I think that's a pretty good trajectory for the day. Nothing too crazy, but straightforward. You know, I'm not going to lie. That desert kind of threw me a little bit for a loop because there was a lot of time commitment required to go there so yeah it was kind of a thing all right anyways here we are hello clint we are going to process some geodes please give me that give me that good stuff 
Give me that good stuff. All right. Let's go through and uh, hopefully we get some nice uh, loot. All right. Now we get into the good stuff. The mystery boxes. Nice. Glowstone ring. Warp totem. Bombs. And a book. Book of mysteries. What is that? Oh, hello. Slightly greater chance of finding mystery books. Very cool. Mystery boxes, sorry. Okay, kind of cool. Um, we didn't get that much. I think we got three things to donate here. So not really breaking the bank, if you know what I mean. But we did get a couple good ones um, like that. And we got some more jammy gems. Um, I feel like I might have to go up here with them. Yeah. So we did at least get a reward. I don't remember what it is. Oh, that's right. It's a crystallarium. Huge reward, to say the least. All right. Very nice loot. Uh, I'm a big fan. Very, very big fan of that. All right. We are on the 18th day. We have 10 days left. Um, we need another 90... Four, uh, blue jazz okay and that will basically finish that off for us not too shabby all right gathering of coal completed excellent let's head on back to our house very briefly uh drop off some things and then we got to head up to the mine as quick as possible here so as much as i need to go to the mine I also need to go and pick my mastery. I'm not going to cliffhanger you that bad. All right. Let's go on in to the mastery cave. All right. We are available. Um, okay. Uh, this is interesting. Because we haven't done the volcano yet. We could do the combat mastery. And it allows for trinkets, which are kind of cool. Um, kind of neat. I mean, mystic tree seeds are good. Treasure totems are good. I like all of this stuff. But is it good for us right now? Um, up to two bobbers. Okay. Challenge bait. Yeah. Triple the fish. Yeah. Uh, golden fishing chest. And let's see. Choose from two mining-related powers and then the heavy furnace, which I don't really need as much. I think I'm going to go combat, actually, because I think we can get the mini forge potentially before even completing the volcano. I don't know that for sure, but let's find out. Oh, you do need a lot of dragon teeth. I might... I don't think I have five, but you don't have to complete the the volcano technically for this. So, yeah, interesting. Okay. Um, hmm, might not have been worth. Might not have been worth. We do get the anvil as well. 50 iron bars. All right. And what was the other thing I got from that? I don't remember. Masteries. Does it not show you? Where does it show you the combat like mastery thing hmm i feel like that's a bit of a oh right here okay trinkets while adventuring okay that's the other one okay good golden animal crackers from farming yeah i, I haven't seen a single golden animal pig you're a long way from home all right uh let me just grab some bombs i guess and you know what? Could probably sell these items as well. And let's head on up to the mines. We gotta find that prismatic jelly uh here ASAP. So let's jump to the mines. We'll go on out to the adventurers guild and turn in and sell these items and then uh carry on for the rest of the day. Uh boom, boom. Cool. Money. I'll take it. Uh anything from you? Come back when you got something to show for it, kid. All right, fair enough. Fair enough. All right, we need prismatic jellies. I believe those are best on floors 45 and such. 
so I'll probably be doing the age-old uh, rinse, repeat, reset strategy that almost everyone knows and does not love, but it is a thing. Um, it's also a great way to get coal, by the way, in case you're looking for something like that, you know? But, uh, yeah. One of those little details. All right. Uh, I'm going to get these guys. Thank you. Thank you. Get out of here. And, uh, basically I go from 45, I go down to 50. I usually go 45, 55, and then 50. I think fi 51 here is a very good one for potential ghosts. Um, but it doesn't look like I'm very lucky, uh, today at all. Mind you, I did get a secret note. That's fine. Yeah, not the best of luck so far to start. All right, well, I did not get lucky with the prismatic jelly, but I did get lucky in a couple of other ways, and let's go through them very shortly here. Yeah, you saw them briefly. It looks like we've got a couple of trinkets on our hands, which is really just good fun. Uh, to say the least. So, yeah, pretty excited about that. I don't know. Let's see. Uh, shoots a magic arrow at nearby enemies every 1.2 seconds, dealing 25 to 30. Summons a level 3 fairy companion that heals you in combat situations. Uh, excuse me? They both sound amazing. So I just put it there, basically. So now I have that magic arrow equipped. 1.2 seconds? That's pretty quick. So that's basically going to fire out a shot every monster. But, like, the fairy could be good. I don't know. I'm going to have to play around with it. I'm going to have to take a look. Uh, and I know I can reforge them for more iridium, but we're not going to be doing that right yet. So, nice. What did I sell? Blue Jazz? Fairy Rose. Yeah, see? The fairy rose, oh, and six grand worth of mayo. Yeah, so not even still all that much, but yeah, little details. Anyways, that's going to do it for this episode. We have gone well over time. We are at least up to 55,000, which is good, but uh, a long ways still yet to go. Uh, our, we got a lot more experience to gain, but it wasn't too bad. It felt pretty smooth, not going to lie. And it's also a Friday, so that means we can go see our friend Krobus if we want to. Or, well, there's plenty of other stuff to get done around here. Nothing posted, nothing happening. Simple day. Bye-bye.